Okay, Shanghai and Stockholm, we want to move over to our schedule now. How did they do this? Oh. <laughs> they compose it together? Boy, this is far out, I'm telling you. I've never seen anything like this in my life, you know. I had the concept to do this project probably five or six years ago. Hi, my name is... My name is... His my name, name is... My name is... Zhang Zhengjie. All of the students worked on this. And this is what you have here. Okay, so this is the chi basic Chinese theme, right? Right. Yeah, it, it, and it, all of the, the kids doing the, 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 the development on it. Yeah. The communal development. Yeah, right. Okay. Right. Hi, my name is Rita. My name is Tim. Chile. Beyond the project's musical goals, it was designed to bring students together. Prove that it didn't matter what country you were from and what background you came from, but you could all work together. It's good to kind of prepare yourselves for uh, a shrinking world. Do you practice Konska? So you can't do it, so you can produce a concert with folk music. What's the music producer? You can't do it, but you can do it. We're all writing clips of music, each individual student, and then in January we'll be going to China to share these clips of music. Okay, you are welcome to China. Huh? That's oh, thank you. <laughs> it's my first time to show my music to people from different countries. It's the first time I will remember it. My A token is called Yeah, the Bilotan. These tokens were musical artifacts for exchange with another culture. Think about what education could be for our global citizens of the world. I have it. If we come to Stockholm and we don't have our materials together, then we don't have a chance to get it done. Yeah, yeah. This is the sketch for the final composition. It was handed to us in May by Bank Darnas. I put up a time axis over 50 minutes, then divided that in four parts. Each school during the summer was to write three themes, and then the students decided which ones they wanted to have. Tema two groups. Yeah, look at it. Tema three groups. Yeah. I'm having contact with Weiwei, we mail each other, and uh, every mail I get, her English is just uh, getting better and better. I learned a lot of computer and MIDI. I never touched them before, never. I never touched the kind of music before. I just learned classical music. <laughs> This is the second day of um, the Clark Terry workshop, and he's one of the mentors, and he's going to end up playing in the end performance with us. My lip used to bleed when I played trumpet, so Clark Terry showed me how to put the trumpet on top of my lip so it didn't bleed when I played high notes, you know. And, you know, that's, that's what it's about. It's, uh, it's like the rites of passage, really. And then a guy like Aaron Copeland would take the same idea in the, in the 1900s, and he went. <laughs> then you could get it to rock and roll. I mean, there's no quicker or better way to learn than being at the side of somebody that really knows what they're doing.
Up to now, we've been concentrating on country, say, vertically. In the next phase, we're talking horizontally. You will all be mixed. You'll all be working together. Ready, study, go. Hit. give us an assignment, we're like, okay, oh, let's please. talk to our trio members and see yeah. what they're doing. Board. The synthesizer in here. And xylophone, percussion. I have uh, learned about two different cultures halfway around the world from, from where I live. And that's one of the most beautiful things that ever happened to me. The music for this section was started in Stockholm in person and it was finished over email. This collage okay. here, does that involve all of the elements? Yeah. That's a, that's a combination of all three yeah, elements. Right? <laughs> this is beautiful, man. This is very beautiful, complex and laid instruction. I love that. Try to find the same how to communicate, how to be like together. We entered the project, we just know the American people, Swedish people in, on TV. We just uh, see them, I, we know they got uh, yellow hair, blue eyes. We can't, we, we didn't know how they, what way they think, and what way they work, and what way they, uh, what way they live. I mean, you really think about yourself as an American, and as well as a, a yourself as a citizen of the entire world. And you really have to, um, it puts everything into perspective a lot better. The hope for the future is, is that we'll, we'll honor diversity, but we'll celebrate commonality, where we can find a place where we can communicate with each other and have relationship with each other without conflict. That's the hope. The most important thing for me to learn is human are all the same. That's what I learned.